I think I have everything. <laughs> Excellent, Jensen. I knew I could trust you. My guys got their hands on Double T, and you identified the shipment. Apparently you weren't so subtle with the last part, but hey, at least the job is done. What else you got? I paid a little B&E visit to O'Malley's apartment. There was a second shipment of weapons, government issue. I don't know how he got his hands on that type of hardware, but the man's got reach. Great work. Found something else? I found a stash of illegal drugs. Not much, but enough to get him convicted. Good. The more dirt we dig up on that asshole, the better our chances to put him away for good. Got anything else? I managed to hack into his personal account. I think you might want to check any connection O'Malley has with FEMA. There's definitely something going on there. My god, Jensen. With all you've uncovered, you've probably provided us with months of legal investigation. What's next? You're gonna tell me you found proof he's got free satellite TV? No, that about covers it. Here's the weapon used in the dealer's murder. Hope you can make good use of it. You bet, big boy. I've got a feeling O'Malley's guy will become a lot more receptive to interrogation once he knows I can pin this murder on him. I think O'Malley's plan was to start a controlled gang war between the derelict row ballers and the Motor City Bangers. You might want to check into that. Really? All right, I'll keep that in mind when I review all the evidence. Well, that's it. You did a great job. Here's the stuff I promised you. We've got more than enough to nail him now, and I want to make a move before that son of a bitch gets wise. But I ain't got no backup, and I doubt he'll go down peacefully. You've already done the bulk of the job. You want to put the finishing touches on yourself? It'll be my pleasure. Perfect. My contact tells me O'Malley's gone back to his apartment. Go get him. I'll be waiting for you in the alley near the building once you've taken care of that scumbag. Put it away, man. Hey, you are.
been happening. I got your back! Jensen. My god, it's been a while. Remember me? We used to work the old 17th precinct back in the day. Man. I wish I could go with the good old you haven't changed at all bit, but that'd be complete and utter bullshit, right? Yeah, I guess that's one way to put it. You look a little different too, Xander. What's your new gig? Deep cover. I'm keeping tabs on the derelict rowballers for now. I've got a hunch something big's coming. Why do I get the sudden feeling you're about to include me into that something big? Because you're clever. That and the fact that, well, it's pretty obvious. But jokes aside, you couldn't have come at a better time, Jensen. This case I'm on? We're stalling and we could use a little external help. Go ahead. I'm with IA now, and we're working a sting on a dirty cop named Jack O'Malley. Elusive, motherfucker. I mean, men in black elusive. We know he's involved in drugs, weapon dealing, tied into the gangs. But he's clever, and we just can't seem to pin anything on him. I swear he's got friends in high places. Okay, and where do I fit in all this? You're an outsider. You can go places we legally can't. I need someone to do a couple of things. Break into his apartment, sneak into DRB territory, and finally, go undercover posing as a hitman. This guy is nothing minor, Jensen. He's the real deal. Major player, major consequences. We have to get him before shit hits a fan. You in? I think we'll skip the trial for this one. Son of a bitch made a mistake of pulling a gun on me. Shit, Jensen. This is gonna make my job a whole lot more difficult. I mean, we got enough evidence to convict him, but now I have to come up with a nice story for all this mess. Well, I'm sure you did what you had to do. Anyway, I gotta get back on this thing. Good luck with whatever you're working on these days. Get him! This is the spot, man! Jesus! What happened to you? Doesn't make sense. I know something was there. 